Coming up on the Kirby Report, today is the deadline for the first payment for the eighth grade trip. And uh, we have got Chromebook reminders for you. The Kirby Report starts now. Now, from the Hounds broadcast team, you're watching the Kirby Report. What's up, Kirby? I'm Cameron. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with a liberty and justice for all. The Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one indivisible. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. You may be seated. CIS has an after-school adjunct program, ASAP, that runs from 3.30, 3.10 to 5 p.m., Monday through Thursday. We approved academic enhancement opportunities for all kids, students, each day after achievements, I mean after activities, students receive a hot meal provided by the Wichita Falls Area Food Bank. The program is a safe and healthy environment for students. To engage in activity, students receive services in individual ac 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 academic tutoring and enhancement, mentoring in academic enhancement community service learning, leadership de development, life skills, college career prep, college volunteers, art activities, and so much more. There is turning tutoring buses that runs for you to get home also. If you left your clothes with Mrs. Her Herman Hermanses last, last semester and borrowed clothes from the CIS closet, you need to pick up your items. If, you, if they are not picked up by tomorrow, the items will be donated to Faith Mission. There is still time to pay the 56th first payment for the 8th grade trip to Colorado. The payment can be made until the Friday to Mrs. Fox in room B109. Next Tuesday is dress up day. Is red ca car carpet ready. Students should dress in their fanciest attire. Glam it up. Sixth grade students, listen up. Starting the third six weeks, if your Chromebook is caught without a cover, you will be charged $45. And your Chromebook will be taken up and turned in until you, until, until you pay it back. There are also fees on $5 for picking up your lost or forgotten Chromebook or for not bringing it ch uh, charged and having to check out a library one if you don't return the library chromebook you will be charged five dollars per day until it returned there is also a three dollar fee charge your chromebook for your you if you if your chromebook are in repair or you have not been issued a Chromebook, you will not be charged to use a library one as long as it is returned before the end of the day. Chromebook reminders. We also have some reminders for your Chromebooks. You, your chargers should not be brought to school with you. Leave them at home and do not leave them to anyone else. Also, do not lead, leave your Chromebook to anyone. Lend your Chromebook to anyone else. Please do not pr try pry up the keys on your keyboard. They do not just snap back on end. The whole keyboard will be to be replaced. You may decorate the cover on your Chromebook, but n leave the inside and the keys area as it is. Finally, do not open your Chromebook flat or you will break it. Have you brought your yearbook? 
Have you bought a yearbook? There is still time to buy a yearbook for $50. Purchase it in room E105. You can also send your pictures to in the yearbook. All you have to do is download the Washworth Yearbook Snap app and, unlo and unload your pictures. Have you signed up for the uh, remind reminders for Kirby? Get the information on the upcoming events, weather deliveries, and uh, counselors, and more. Right to you. Phone text at KJ KJH Hounds to eight one zero one ten to sign up. Here's a look at the forecast today. Today we'll shower a likely mainly before noon. Skies will be cloudy with a high near 34. Tonight showers are likely. Skies will be cloudy with a low around 34. Saturday showers are likely. Skies will be cloudy with a high near 38. Saturday night there is a 50% chance of showers. Skies will be mostly cloudy with a low around 37. Sunday will be showers and thunderstorm with a high near 60 chance of precipitation is 80. Now for a look at the world of sports. Woo woo! Games next. The Lady Hounds basketball C team woo, will tr tip off against McNeil on Wednesday at 4 p.m. in the McNeil gym. The Hounds and Lady Hounds A and B woo woo teams will be taking on McNeil on Thursday at 4 p.m. The Hounds will be playing at Kirby, and then the Lady Hounds will be playing at McNeil. Mmm, the lunch. You can get nachos or a chicken sandwich. Side dishes are steamed cabbage, baby carrots, and pineapples. That's a look at today's lunch menu. We need your news and events. If you have any information, you can email it at us at shorts at wfisd.net. Place it in Mr. Sources box or drop it off right here in room E105. That's it for the Curry Report. Have a great weekend, and we'll see you on Monday. I mean Tuesday.